welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing you guys a packing video. I thought it'd be really fun to show you guys what I'm packing for my trip to Austin tomorrow. So I'm legit packing for my trip and I thought it'd be fun to show you some of the new things that I've purchased to make my packing a little bit more efficient and organized because I usually am not very organized when I'm packing. I kind of just throw a bunch of stuff together and call it a day. So I'm really hoping that this is gonna help me and I thought maybe it would help you as well. So tomorrow morning I'm leaving for Texas. I'm going to a summit called Mom 2.0 and it's a bloggers conference and um, it's for motherhood and lifestyle related content creators. So I'm so excited because I'm finally gonna be able to meet some of the ladies that I've gotten to know in the last few years on Instagram. Um, and meet them in person as well as other businesses that I've um, worked with or hopefully will work with in the future. I'm really excited. Hopefully I learn a ton so I can make my blog even better. So some of the things I'm not going to be including just because I have not packed them and I'll be using them in the morning and they're just like little things that you know are just like essential things but um, for the most part I have the majority of everything that I'm going to be packing laid out on my bed and I'm going to go through those with you guys okay so this bag right here is the one that I'm going to be taking tomorrow um, for traveling because it's a nice big tote I just bought this one and I actually um, have a video I was talking about this tote I will link this video for you guys in the description box and also on one of the i cards these are the pairs of shoes that i'm taking these were also included in this video i'm bringing a pair of more like nicer shoes casual flip-flops tennies and some nice sandal espadrilles for the trip i wanted to go lightly on the shoes because sometimes i overpack in the shoe department and it takes up a lot of room i'm also bringing a sweater and a white denim jacket so um, if it gets cold that I have something to keep me a little bit on the warm side um, I'm also bringing this gray sweater which is like a long cardigan sweater because that's what I'm gonna be wearing I think on the way um, home when I travel home and I'm just bringing a pair of black leggings and a black t-shirt to go with that I'm bringing a white bodysuit a black tank top and a pair of like shorts to go under my dresses you guys I went crazy but I'm bringing a ton of different dresses I feel most myself and most comfortable in dresses and the weather is supposed to be a little sketchy it's gonna be kind of rainy some of the days and a little bit warmer and hot um, but then also sunny and hot on some of the days so we'll see how that goes I also um, we'll be bringing a pink trench coat that I totally forgot to bring up here and that is going to go inside of the bag as well so that when it rains I have my trench coat and I'm also including an umbrella which I need to bring up here as well I have a two pairs of pajamas these are just some cute Ralph Lauren night shirts um, that I thought would be just cozy and comfortable to wear along with a pair of slippers. I'm also including a planner and a notebook to take notes in. I bought these packing cubes so I'm going to be packing up everything inside of these packing cubes so I'm gonna try to fit as much as I can inside of these packing cubes and whatever I can't fit I'll just pack in my bags bringing another little um, backpack um, purse type bag for the trip this is just like a little convertible mini backpack but that you can also wear over the shoulder and I just thought this would be really convenient I need to paint my nails still <laughs> and I just bought a nicer bag in case we do some thing at night and I just want a little bit nicer of a bag. I have all my toiletries in this bag right here. Um, just things that I use on the daily. I got a new toothbrush. I usually use a um, an electric toothbrush, but my husband and I share the charger, so I'm just gonna take this for the trip and that'll be no problem. I also picked these up just in case I need them for my shoes that um, are a little bit more fancy so that my feet can stay comfortable and I thought I would try this as well just in case um, you know walking around a lot and everything I could get um, friction on my little pinky toe in one of the shoes so I'm bringing this as well and hopefully that will work I'm also bringing a breast pump because 
my daughter still nurses and she is down to like one to two feedings a day but overnight I get kind of full so this is to relieve like morning after I sleep so that I'm able to feel like I can go out throughout the day and not feel super full of milk. These are some of the pieces of jewelry that I'm bringing. This is more of like a fancier bracelet for like a night out. I did bring some stud earrings that are just comfortable, pearls, and then these. Um, another little gold necklace, some of these little Druzy earrings. These are from Amazon. My Lily Pulitzer tassel earrings. These are both from Red Dress Boutique, and these are from Amazon. This from Loft Outlet. This is from Nordstrom and this is from Macy's. This is my watch that I wear like every single day. My annual Wellington watch is like my go-to. I have this gold bracelet that I've had for years that I always wear and I also thought it'd be fun to bring a gold anklet. So this little case here I found on Amazon and this I got for my jewelry. It's a little jewelry organizer. It's really cute. So I'm going to put some of my rings in there and I'll put the rest of my jewelry um, and I also am going to bring like a little bag that ties for my tassel earrings. But this has like a little mirror and then it also opens up right here and I can hang my more delicate jewelry pieces in there. And I just thought that it was really cute and convenient. So I'm going to be wearing this tomorrow so I'm not packing that. But this is the little, um, this is just a little pouch that I'm going to take all my tassel earrings in and I've packed my jewelry in here so it fits nicely in here so I was at Sephora last week and I picked up this cute little kit it came in this little bag and it was kind of like a little travel kit so the reason why I got it was because it had these in the bag and I thought that was a really good deal so these are the Isle of Paradise tanning drops and these are for your face so you just mix these in a moisturizer and it'll tan up your face so if your face is looking a little bit white you can use these to tan it up so this also came with the Brazilian bum bum cream I've never used this before but we'll see if it works it also came with this um, really nice lip balm from Fresh. It's a sugar advanced therapy. This mini um, Volition Prismatic Luminizing Shield in SPF 50, so that's really good to have for your, under your makeup. Also this moisturizer, um, I actually been using this a little bit and it's really nice. I like it, it's a lightweight formula. And you guys, I think I need to buy a full size of this. It's so nice, it has SPF 40, and it helps minimize your pores. All right, so here are the makeup items that I'm bringing for the trip. Um, we're just gonna start off here. I'm bringing my Too Faced Peach Palette for eyeshadows because I love all the colors in here. Also bringing my Stellar Palette. This, I love, love this bronzer, you guys, and the highlights are beautiful. I'm bringing some of my Kirkland Facial wipes because these are so good for taking makeup off. I'm bringing my Laura Geller Bake and Body Tahitian Glow because this stuff is magic. I forgot to show you guys what the bag looked like. It is so, so cute. This is from Amazon and I can't believe I forgot to show you. Okay, so this is the cutest little pink bag. It has pink polka dots inside um, and this is what it looks like and I love that it has this Velcro so you can adjust it to however you need it to fit your makeup. So I'm just putting my bigger palettes and stuff in here and like I'm filling up these little spots. For foundation and stuff and base um, face, I'm bringing my Hollywood Flawless filter you guys from Charlotte Tilbury this is so amazing I love this so much and it's been giving me such a beautiful glowy look so I've been using this Neutrogena Hydro Boost you guys and I love this so much I have it in the shade 40 nude and this is what I'm bringing for foundation it's lightweight and it's just beautiful I'm bringing these two um, concealers this one's from Flower Beauty and this one's from Tarte this is the shape tape these are really good um, concealers and I really love these. The powder I'm bringing is from Stellar. This is their face powder um, in Haze. You guys, this stuff is so amazing. 
I love this powder so, so much. So I'm bringing these two blushes. This one's from Laura Geller and Milani. This is the Luminoso. And this one is in Bali. This is the baked blush. And my blush is just falling out of the container. Like, go figure the time that I want to use it. This is one of my favorite colors that I have. Um, it's just such a beautiful pink color. I'm bringing this Pixie liquid lipstick. This is in the color pastel petal and it's just such a beautiful color so nude and beautiful but has like a little bit of pinky to peachy to it i'm bringing my protect and perfect intense advanced eye cream from number seven and also the protect and perfect lip care also the je ne sais quoi from um it i love this stuff you guys I'm bringing three like little sample um perfumes because they're easy to travel with <laughs> Also a um, sharpener. I'm bringing, I, oh wait, I don't need this anymore. I forgot that I have my extensions in, yay! Um, I'm bringing this for my extensions. Um, and then for my eyebrows, I'm bringing this little Brow Conditioning Primer from Benefit along with the Cabrow. I'm bringing some tweezers for those pesky hairs. I'm bringing just a hair clip so when I do my hair, for when I do my hair, I mean. And then um, I love this for highlighting the inner corner of my eyes. I got this in one of my FabFitFun boxes and I really have been loving this so much. This is a liquid eyeliner in case I want to get crazy and do some liquid eyeliner. This is the tattoo liner from Kat Von D. Then I also have my Stellar um, eyeliner that's just like a roll-up black um, liner. It's really nice. Then I also have an in a waterline liner which is from Lancome and this just really makes your eyes pop. And I'm bringing one lip liner MAC and this is in the color Whirl. I'm bringing a beauty blender. I love this because it has like an area for all your brushes and actually I am going to clean all these brushes tonight so they are nice and clean for tomorrow. And everything just fits so nicely in there and I just love this little pink polka dot. It's so cute you guys. Okay, so I love this little bag I got from 31 like years ago. Um, I love it because inside it's lined with like a plastic inside, so it's really good for packing like these types of bath products. But I'm just bringing some face um, pads with some micellar water, especially because for like eyeliner stuff to clean my lashes because I'm wearing lash extensions, a brush. Um, night cream. This is from um, Skin Iceland. I'm bringing my Batiste volum Volumizing Dry Shampoo, which like I live for. My hair conditioner, my leave-in conditioner from Way. Oh, I love this hairspray so much, you guys. This is amazing hairspray. Some shaving cream. This, oh yes. I need to buy more of this, but this is like a gel um, kind of consistency and it's like a really nice just glowy bronzy tint that you can give to your skin and then I'm bringing this um, Neutrogena body mist um, for like when I go to the if, if we go swimming or go to the pool I'll have this or like if we're out and about and I need any kind of extra sun protection I'm just bringing some pads in case uh, my period starts earlier than it's supposed to but you never know so I'm just being cautious um, I'm bringing my own hair dryer because I live for my lounge hair dryer um, and uh, my lounge um, curling wand. It's amazing. This is like a little another 31 product I got years ago, and it holds your hair or your hot tools like inside where it keeps it from burning. So if it's warm, you can take it and put it in there no matter what. I'm also bringing some breast pads because still leaking. So Luke picked me up some snacks from the store, which was really nice. So these are the things that he picked up for me. And then also I'm bringing mints and I need this for when I'm taking off and landing to make sure that like, my ears don't have any problems because I can get like ear really bad ear problems if I'm not chewing something. I'm like a big baby. <laughs> So I'm probably forgetting things. Um, I need to go through and kind of rethink about like what I have to use on the daily. Um, I know that I'm also bringing like some 
nail polish stuff just to touch up in case like nail clippers if you you know or nail file or nail clippers those types of things if you need to fix any kind of problems with uh, your nails because sometimes that happens to me where my nail like breaks or something and I need to fix it up <laughs> um, and then obviously like my phone and chargers and all that good stuff um, and yeah so I'm gonna start packing my stuff up and see how it goes really quickly wanted to show you guys my luggage before I start packing because I completely forgot to do that so this is the luggage that I got this is just my carry-on I have my bigger one over there um, this one is from iFly and it has like all the rose gold details and the rose like spinning wheels which I love um, has the rose gold handle here um, and it's really lightweight and so I think that's like super important when you're traveling to make sure that you start off with lightweight luggage um, because I mean, that means you could just pack more, right? <laughs> so yeah, I'm really excited about this. It's like a really like plasticky feeling outside. And I know like it's white and it's gonna get scuffed up and everything and I can try to like get the scuffs out afterwards, but I just loved it so much. They had like some really, really fun colors. Um, but I decided to go with white because I just was drawn to that. I just love a good white. So that is what my luggage looks like on the outside. This is what it looks like inside. Um, it's really, really pretty. And on one side it has the straps and then on the other side it has the zipper so you can zipper everything that you need behind this and keep it separated, which I really, really liked. Um, it also has a mesh pocket zipper.
right guys, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I still have some things that I need to pack for tomorrow, like undergarments and things that I'm finished washing up. That I'm finished washing up? Things that I'm finishing washing up and like my computer and my charger and those things, earbuds, all that good, good stuff. Um, so I'll be packing that and also like the outfit that I'm going to be wearing tomorrow. So anyways, for the most part, I have everything packed. I hope that I was able to give you guys some good tips um, or show you some things that maybe you guys haven't seen before for packing. And yeah, I'm so excited about tomorrow, you guys. I'm also kind of nervous. It's been a really long time since I've traveled by myself, especially like leaving my baby. Babies. It's just really hard. It's been like over seven years since I've left and been anywhere on my own So it's like really weird and like nerve-wracking <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching get to go hit that subscribe button below like this video and wish me good luck on my safe travels And if you guys want to keep updated go follow me over on my Instagram. I'm at home with Haley I will be updating you guys daily over on my stories and posting um, while I'm in Austin, if you guys want to keep up with my travels, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. I go anywhere, anywhere with you, cause you feel my mind, or you feel my mind. We could build a dream, start up something.